All right. All right, welcome, welcome to the grand opening of Tesla Global Engineering Headquarters. Uh, uh, this, is, this is definitely the, mo the wildest party I've ever seen in Palo Alto. <laughs> like next level. <laughs> so, uh, I hope you all have a great time here tonight, um, and I'm excited to share some updates. So, um, yeah, Let's see. So this is actually, this year will be the 20th year of, of the creation of, since the, since the creation of Tesla. So uh, it's pretty wild to think what's happened in, in two decades uh, from basically a test ride in the, the AC propulsion T0 to now making, you know, now we have millions of cars on the road and we've got several models. We've got the Cybertruck coming out later this year, which is gonna be epic. So, and I think we've got uh, a whole bunch of Cybertruck uh, pre-production units that you can check out. So it's pretty, it's gonna be an amazing car, something that's gonna change the look of the, of the roads. And um, yeah, it's gonna be, be great. So uh, we've got uh, developing Optimus here. Uh, I mean, we're really building a better future for humanity right here in Palo Alto. End of, yeah, so. so. I'm just reflecting on the immense amount of stuff that has happened in the last 20 years. It's like, whoa. <laughs> so, um, in fact, we, we have uh, now 48,000 employees in California. So, um, and we're the, the biggest manufacturing em employer in the, in the state by a factor of two. Um, and uh, Fremont uh, Manufacturing is the biggest uh, automotive plant in North America, highest output. It's to hand to the uh, Fremont team. So it's, it's pretty incredible what the Tesla Fremont manufacturing is, is producing. It's an incredible number of vehicles. So uh, yeah, and run, running 24-7, it's incredible. And, um, and yeah, and, and then last year, the Model Y and Model 3 were the number one and number two best-selling cars in the state of California. Oh. Oh. <laughs> so, yes. Um, now, when we when we started out, and actually for many years, they said what we were doing was uh, impossible. Um, and uh, th then, when we did, weren't quite on schedule, they were say we're, we're just late. And that's why, like, we specialize in making the impossible merely late. <laughs> <laughs> so. Um, yeah, <laughs> the sheer number of articles saying this was impossible is insane. Uh, so, and, and I think we've, we've, we've also done a lot to uh, get the whole uh, industry and, and Earth thinking uh, in the direction of electric vehicles. Uh, you know, we open sourced our patents, made our patents available, and have really tried everything we can to encourage the rest of the industry to move towards sustainability. Um, and that's uh, thanks to all of your uh, hard work. So my hat is off to you. Yeah. Uh, yeah, and it's, you know, when, when we started out, no one believed in, they were, in EVs, there were, no one was producing EVs, um, and now the industry has accepted that electric vehicles are the future, so it's pretty wild. So, yeah, um, we've got, obviously, so this, this is our global engineering headquarters, we've got uh, a gigantic manufacturing facility in Fremont, we've got Lathrop. Um, we've got a, a big center in Los Angeles and also uh, operations in San Diego, so throughout the state. And um, yeah, doing software and hardware. And I, you know, I often say like Tesla is as much a software company as it is a hardware company. So yeah, um, we're doing a lot. <laughs> so we've got the stationary storage, the, yeah. 
So, um, we're looking, we're looking forward to uh, on uh, Investor Day on March 1st, coming up soon. Uh, just, uh, and, and it's going to be sort of Investor Day that is uh, not just for Tesla investors, but kind of like investors uh, in Earth. And, and just sort of explaining how we get to a fully sustainable energy future um, and that people should have optimism and hope for the future. That they should not be, we shouldn't be complacent, but they should not feel that uh, there's no hope for the future because there, there absolutely is. And, uh, you know, we're, we're, along with the rest of industry, we're going to make it happen. So uh, believe in the future. Yeah, so you can see we've really, we have a lot of people here. Um, and so although we are obviously expanding in many parts of the world, uh, it, we've continued to expand in California the entire time. So uh, you know, every year we've, we've grown uh, our headcount in California significantly, and we expect that to continue in the future. And yeah, I've invested $5 billion since 2016. So, and, and right now we're doing uh, almost uh, $45 million per day uh, of value creation in the California economy. So, yeah. And this is our cool new uh, Tesla Engineering HQ. Now, I, the thing that I think is really, uh, I mean, warms my heart and I think is uh, pretty incredible is that this uh, is, uh, uh, Hewlett Packard's uh, original headquarters. So this is where they they, they created uh, Hewlett Packard, um, and uh, which was really the foundation of Silicon Valley. And so we're, I think, inheriting an incredible legacy here. Um, and uh, and also they, they did really really good, great decor. Um, <laughs> so. Uh, we're quite appreciative of this nice place. Um, and, um, but I think it's, it's pretty, it's a, it's a nice sort of um, poetic transition from um, HP to Tesla. Um, and we, we, we obviously intend to carry, keep carrying that torch forward. So, yeah. Yeah, that's uh, 2008, I guess, 15 years ago. So anyway, we're the, I hope you guys have a fantastic time tonight. Um, welcome to our new Global Hed Engineering Headquarters, um, and uh, it's going to be epic. We're going to build the future here. Thank you.